Martin Tyler here with you as usual, and delighted to have the company of Alan Smith. Thank you, Martin. It's a pleasure to be here. Game for you today, Sporting Gijon, and they play Real Madrid. Oh, we're here today to watch the champions with the title already sealed nice and relaxed oh yeah just the perfect scenario for these boys they've already been out celebrating so it might not be the best performance here well here is the team sheet for the home side Fernando Amorebieta starts despite looking shaky in recent games and they'll play with a sole striker Changes for Real Madrid. Keylor Navas in goal. Pepe starts alongside Nacho in the heart of defence. Xavi Alonso plays with Luka Modric in the centre of the park. Morata is the sole striker today. Well, you're too young, Alan, but I grew up watching Real Madrid win those European crowns in the 50s when European club football only just started, and they made such an imprint on pretty much everywhere where the television pictures were beamed in those days and they've just moved on from strength to strength. Well, quite simply, they're one of the most famous football clubs in the world, aren't they? Perhaps the most famous. It's what we've been waiting for. The kick-off, the game is underway. Getting into an advanced position, Cristiano Ronaldo. Morata! Great stop. Carvajal. Now, Javi Alonso. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. Cross coming in from Cristiano Ronaldo. He could do a better cross than that, I think. And it was easy to cope with. He is still, I guess, the pin-up boy of world football. He is Cristiano Ronaldo. Good to see him. Well, if you're the uh, opposing defence here, how do you contain him? Shots on here. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. This should be a comfortable fixture for Real Madrid. It's a terrible place to give the ball away. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. To put them in front. He's right in. The big hitters have hit again, they go in front, and with their attacking prowess, no one's surprised here. It's just a matter of who's going to score the goals, you know they are going to score, and they've got so many different ways of breaking down the opposition. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. There's a chance for a double for the team that are the visiting team today. Had a good win against this side that they're visiting in the uh, other match between the two clubs earlier in the season. But I'm sure the hosts are really determined to uh, uh, get some revenge. Yeah, I'm sure they are. They should be because they didn't play well in that earlier game. But a great chance here for the visitors to take six points off the, their opponents. Javi Alonso. It was good play until they got that challenge in. Good. And a foul by the Real Madrid man. It's yellow from the ref. Oh, without question. Was that just a case of mistiming the tackle? Well, I think so. The referee doesn't need to make a 
the mountain out of this molehill, but uh, it is a foul. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. He's fouled by Ronaldo. Referees produced the yellow card for Real Madrid. They can have no complaints looking at that. Did you see anything cynical in that, Alan? Oh, that is a clumsy tackle. It really is. And no question it was a foul. Well, There's good progress with this attack. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. This could be a real benchmark for the visiting team today because if they win this game, they'll take their current run to 10 consecutive victories. Well, that's something to aim for, and what a marvellous total it would be. They played some great stuff, really good. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Good play, but they've lost the ball now, and the opposition could get at them. Morata. Fabio Coentrao, in quickly. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. It'll be a throw now after the tackle. Here's the cross. They put that cross far too close to the goalkeeper. Well, we're looking at a Real Madrid team that had the lead but aren't really believing. It's quite surprising, I think, that they're not pushing on from this position. Maybe they will in the second half. Gareth Bale. Now, Javi Alonso. On to Ronaldo. They've got a great understanding, this team. Just look at the passing. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Shot on! Taking the chance with the shot there. Yeah, thought he might have done better there. Had a bit of time and space. Good position. <laughs> it's Isco. Good to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. We've got two added minutes. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Well, that's half time at 1 0. Start of the second half with Real Madrid at the moment out in front. Nice interplay between the two of them. Cristiano Ronaldo. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looks very encouraging. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well didn't he and he got himself a goal to put his team ahead he'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes and here's the shot he's missed the target by quite a lot in the end on EA Sports very soon our coverage of the La Liga fixture Sporting Gijon they'll be facing Osasuna away from home yeah three points at stake it's a big match for both sides a miss a narrow miss otherwise we'd have been talking about one of the goals of the season well they cut through the defense on the breakaway and all it needed was a composed head at the end
And they're looking to make the change now as quickly as possible, the home team. As for Real Madrid, their next game, Alan? They're playing Manchester City in their next match in the Champions. Chooses to punch here, the goalkeeper. Good technique. And it's been an hour of very good football here. We've still got 30 more minutes to go, and I'm sure we're going to enjoy that as well. Modric. And here come Real Madrid. Morata! Terrific stop. Here's Isco. Javi Alonso. Well, they're in a good position here. Well, this is how this team can play sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. A timely challenge. Cristiano Ronaldo. Modric. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. It's looking good, this move. He's got support here. And now the shot! Well, he's been a marksman in this match, and made a good contribution to it it could have been a massive contribution there i don't know whether he just took his eye off the ball thought the chance was a little too simple he's on a high after scoring already but uh, let himself down there Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Real Madrid looking good with this attack. And he gives it back to him. He's got his shot off now. Oh, that's a good save. He got a touch to that. It's Cristiano Ronaldo to take the corner. Cleared it well. Attacking now. Here's Isco. We do like watching Real Madrid play. They bring a, a power and a pace to their football. And of course, all the history that people like me have grown up with. The younger generation might still be finding out about. Uh, this might be it! Real Madrid get the corner. I think the coach will be considering his options on the bench. Modric. Shot on! Oh, he had a real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't uh, provide the finishing touch. Keep an eye on the time here. We still could have a decisive moment in the short time that remains. Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the shot. He's blocked that well. Well, the atmosphere's improving now. Now the home team need to improve. They're still in with a shout. Yeah, time is running out. It's now or never. I think they've got to lift the game. Here's a chance to attack. Tries the through pass. Crisp defending there. Modric. That's a good challenge. Well, that's fantastic. They've won the league title. And look at the scenes of celebrations. 
wonderful moments for these players. They'll remember all their lives. Well, they will. You're quite right, Martin. They are sweet, sweet moments, and you've just got to drink it all in because you never quite know when it's going to come round again. So uh, you can understand the jubilation out there. They thoroughly deserve what they've achieved. Well, I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Got himself a goal and uh, put in a really good shift. Excellent performance. Good save, he got a touch to that. 